Are you want to install fresh Windows 10 on your computer? If yes, be with us. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the entire installation process step by step. I've already uploaded multiple boot videos, so I will not boot USB in this video. So let's get started. Now that you have the installation media prepared, insert the USB into the computer where you want to install Windows 10. Start your PC, and if your PC already running, restart the system and enter the BIOS or UEFI settings. This is usually done by pressing a specific key like F2, F12, F9, delete or escape during the startup. In my case, it's F9 key. Once inside the BIOS menu, navigate to the boot order settings and click on your USB drive as the boot device. Computer will start from the USB. I've chosen my installation partition as MBR. So the USB booted as legacy, as well as UEFI. So I have to press any key to continue. You should now see the Windows setup screen. Choose your language, time and currency format and keyboard layout. Then click next and select install now. Now you will see three options. First, select STD, standard installation, if you own a key, or you will add it later. Secondly option is DLA, if you have digital activation. And last option is OEM, if your laptop or PC comes with pre-installed windows. I will choose standard installation. Now click next, and then accept the license agreement and click next. At this point, you'll be asked how you want to install windows. If you're upgrading an existing installation and want to keep your files, you can select the upgrade option. However, for a clean installation, click on Custom, Install Windows Only. You'll now see a list of partitions on your hard drive. Select your old Windows drive and click on Format. Once format complete, select the disk and click on Next. The installation process will now begin. Windows 10 will start copying files, installing features and updates, and configuring your system. This process may take anywhere from 20 to 30 minutes depending on your computer hardware. Your computer will restart during the process. Just let it run until you see the setup screen. Now computer will configure some services which are essential for Windows to run. Now another process will start in which your Windows will start getting ready for your device. Once completed, you'll be asked to, let's connect you to a network. At this time, click on, I don't have internet, and then continue with limited setup. Once the installation is complete, you'll go through the first time setup and let Windows finalize the setup. This might take a few more minutes, so don't turn off your computer at this stage. At the time of Windows booting, we skip privacy and regional setting, so it will not be set here. Once everything is done, you'll finally land on the Windows 10 desktop. You now have a clean installation of Windows 10 ready to use. The first thing you should do is activate Windows if you haven't already. Congratulations, you've just installed Windows 10. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Mara's Tech, and let me know in the comments if you want more videos like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.